Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot. I decided to do two two daily vibes because I know there's so many people that watch these, you know, and I know that certain ones are going to be for you and certain ones are not. So I'm going to do another one. I'm going to use two different decks. Um, so this is for July 17th. We're just going to see what comes up. We're going to get one of these and we're going to use this deck. This this reading is not sign specific. You should be watching this on the channel Soul Source Tarot. We're just going to see what comes up for the 17th. This is for a different group of people. Could be for the same group. We're going to see what happens. What do we have for the 17th? Dear God, angels, spirits, and universe, what do we got? Romantic feelings. Your feelings are real and worth exploring. This kind of goes with the last one a little bit because I feel like we do have somebody here that, you know, made a wrong choice. They made a poor choice. And I feel like they, they you know, they have feelings that need to be explored. So, your feelings are real. This could be somebody new as well. There could be somebody new here. Your feelings are real. Somebody is urged to go after what, <laughs> what their heart wants. Wow, we got the Empress. We have the Justice and the Seven of Wands. They came out just like that too, by golly. So, Justice, final decision. Somebody has made a final decision. That this is the truth. The truth coming out. The truth being delivered. Somebody may, you know, decide, be deciding they got to protect their empress. They got to protect their mother. They got to protect their wife. They got to protect the woman that they love. <coughs> this is the birth of a new life. This is a beautiful, abundant energy. Somebody who gives birth. Somebody that has experienced a lot of pain and suffering. This is protecting. So we may have somebody here that feels the need to protect this person. Hmm. Sorry, I need to get a drink. Oh, there's that tower reversed. And the two of cups. Yeah, somebody is wanting to rebuild a foundation with this lovely individual. This person is lovely. She is a creator. She is a gift. She gives birth to a gift. She delivers a gift. She delivers a miracle. She has experienced a lot of pain to become the Empress. The Empress is not a spring chicken. The Empress is somebody who has, experience, has life experience. And life experience typically comes with age. Okay? It comes with age. It comes with life. So, this is doing the right thing, acting with integrity, defending this person. So we may have, and this is, somebody may be defending this person who has experienced some upheaval. There could be some upheaval. And we have somebody here that wants to come in and protect her. Wants to defend her. Wants to take care of her. This is an op this is love, this is a partnership, this is a union. This person may be wanting to push away the others. She has multiple options. She does. She doesn't chase. She sits back she sits back and waits. She's got enough life experience to know better. She's not that woman who is chasing men. No, that's not the Empress. She is wise enough to know better. She's just, she's just, she's got so many options. She's waiting for the one who is going to fight for her. Absolutely. There's so many, and this guy knows that he has to fight for her. If he wants her, he's going to have to fight for her because she knows her value. She knows her worth. She, her experience has made her rich.
Ace of Cups reversed. The Devil. Nine of Wands reversed. Knight of Coins reversed. And the Sun reversed. We got somebody here that is unhappy. They're sad. They haven't moved forward because of the challenge. You know, it's a challenge. It is a challenge. She is a challenge because she knows her value. She will not settle for a playboy. She will not settle for a fuck boy. She will not settle for a player. She will not settle for somebody that has a wife or has another girlfriend. Mm -mm. No. So we have this person that has been avoiding her. They have been. They've been avoiding her because of their ego, because of their pride. Maybe they have addictions. Maybe they've been burying their feelings with addictions to hide their true feelings. They've probably let love slip away because they know they have to come with the truth. They know they have to come with integrity. It feels as though we have somebody here that is very sad and unhappy about letting a foundation crumble that was love. They probably realize that this woman has other options and they're probably, this is making a decision. But there's, there's, there's fear here. The devil is fear, okay, and ego and pride. This person desires to communicate with this person. This person is tempted to step out of their comfort zone, but fear is still in control, okay? Yeah, fear is still in control. There, it is. We have somebody here that is very fearful, very cowardly. We have, a, we have a coward, okay? We have somebody here that just cannot find the strength to face this woman who knows her value, knows her worth. Weak. Very weak. We have a weak individual here that has let pride and ego get in the way. And remember the first card in that last reading was about pride and ego. They've let a love situation die because of pride and ego. They were avoiding challenge. And now they just can't step forward. They just don't have the courage to do so. But they may take action. They may find the courage. They may. They may find the courage. They may find the strength. They may find the confidence within themselves to go after what they want. This person usually goes after what they want. This is a very protective, dominant energy. This person has been feeling weak. This person may have been feeling ill. This person has been delaying, you know, facing this person because of fear of rejection. But now it's like they have to make this choice because there's, there's, other options. She has so many options. It's either shit or get off the pot. Because the pot is boiling. And it's about to boil over. So 
we got somebody here that this is a painful, stressful decision that you can't, somebody has been blocking their true feelings. But it looks to me like blocking their true feelings has caused illness. There's an opportunity to renew a love connection with honesty and integrity. We got a few more cards here we have to play out. We have somebody here that has been living a lie. They've been playing games. They've been deceiving. Very crafty, cunning individual who has given their power away to the devil. Pride, ego. But now it's over. It's too painful. There's too much suffering. There's been too much betrayal. There's been too much deception and it hurts too much. It hurts too much. So we have somebody here that has been suffering in silence. Mostly at night. Night times have been horrendous. And they have been horrendous because this person has been, you know, holding on to a false sense of security based out of pride, based out of ego. But I feel like we have this person that is about to take a noble approach and face their fears and complete a difficult phase in their life. It's like they're going to face their demons. Because holding on has gotten old and I don't know if that was upright or reversed I turned this card multiple times in my hand we're gonna leave it we're gonna put it upright it's the end it's the end of suffering it's the rebirth it's a release it's a major life change it's a transition it's the end Somebody is choosing to end a difficult, painful situation and they are about to go after love. Somebody has been avoiding They've been avoiding the truth. They've been avoiding a challenge. They've been avoiding this beautiful opportunity because of ego and pride. And you think about that the first card in that last one. You know, you think about the shadow side. All is not as it seems. The devil is ruled by the shadow side. In that nine of cups, in that first reading, the same kind of thing. It looked good. Whatever they got themselves involved in looked good. But it wasn't what their heart really wanted. So the advice is, your feelings are real and worth exploring. Follow your heart. There is a very beautiful, abundant person waiting. She's waiting. She's waiting. She is. She's waiting. She's waiting for somebody who is her. her look at this yin and yang. She's right, waiting for her perfect match. She's waiting for somebody to come to her rescue. She's waiting for her hero to arrive. And I think that this hero is about to face his fears and show up. I could make it really dark in here. Too dark, huh?
Good luck.